Hello cherished viewers, welcome to another edition of Chelsea FC News with Brightness. Kindly shows us love by subscribing to this channel and hitting the like button for us. The names and pictures of the first five subscribers today will be featured in our next video. So hit that subscribe button and get featured. In today's edition, we have news and rumors on Chelsea as well as the world of football. The reason why Romelu Lukaku has resigned for Chelsea revealed. Messi appears to be heading to Paris Saint-Germain. As written by the Daily Star, Romelu Lukaku's imminent return to Chelsea will give him another chance to fulfill his childhood dream of scoring for the club, while significantly boosting their Premier League title hopes. I dreamed to play here since I was 10 years old. It was just what I was searching for, Lukaku said when his move from Anderlecht was completed back in August of 2011. Lukaku added, I used to watch Jimmy Floyd Hasselbank scoring goals and remember one against Manchester United, the volley at Old Trafford, and I decided I wanted to support this team. It's amazing to arrive here in a big club with big ambition. It was just what I was searching for. These statements made by Lukaku in 2011 reveal reason why Lukaku is returning to Chelsea. It appears the Belgian has an unfinished business at the bridge amidst the great love he has for Chelsea Football Club. We wish his second coming will be a successful one. In other news, Messi is going to be a PSG player according to the transfer expert Fabrizio Romano. He tweeted, Leo Messi is set to join Paris Saint-Germain, confirmed. Jorge Messi received official contract today morning, after talks since Thursday. Messi is ready to accept, he'll sign with PSG once final details will be fixed. Now planning for travel, medical, unveiling. So PSG appears to have won the race to the signing of Lionel Messi. For this transfer window, PSG have already signed Sergio Ramos, Ashraf Hakimi, Jorginho Wijnaldum, Gianluigi Donnarumma and Danilo Pereira from Porto. PSG are very busy this window. Have you imagined the firepower of a front three of Neymar, Mbappe and Messi? Watch out for PSG in this year's UEFA Champions League. According to Football Italia, Inter's preseason friendly against Parma turned into an opportunity for the fans to insult their club owners over the Romelu Lukaku sale to Chelsea, even waving money at them. The game was at the Stadio Tardini this evening and circa 500 supporters were in attendance. Lukaku was not even on the bench, another sign that his €115 million Euros transfer to Chelsea is imminent, with reports he will have a medical tomorrow. The Ultras spent the entire game aiming abuse at President Steven Zhang and the Sunning Corporation who own the club, including a large banner that read, Zhang if you want to save Inter, then you have to leave. Kai Havertz has set his goal for the impending CAM. He told the official Chelsea website that we all dream of winning the Champions League one day, and of course, now we have to prove it again and again. He added, the Champions League is not enough for us, we want to win more and that is our aim for the season. According to the Express, Chelsea could still sign another three players once Romelu Lukaku transfer completed. These players are Declan Rice of West Ham, Jules Koundé of Sevilla and Alfonso Pedraza of Villarreal. We at Chelsea FC News with Brightness will keep you updated with further developments. On Harry Kane, Manchester City have £190 million planned to tempt Spurs into Harry Kane's sale according to the boot room. Manchester City are prepared to pay £130 million, and throw in Bernardo Silva, according to a report from the Daily Mail. With Silva said to be valued by City at around £60 million, that would see the deal for Kane worth around £190 million in the end. But it is reported that Daniel Levy is sticking to his guns on a £150 million asking price when it comes to Kane, City are looking at other ways of doing a deal. Tottenham manager Nuno on Harry Kane, Harry is with us. He has to quarantine, he's in the lodge but he's training. He already made the first day with the sports science. He's with us. Good. Tweeted by Fabrizio Romano Fabrizio also had an update on Lautaro Martinez to Arsenal rumour. He has reported Lautaro Martinez, agent Alejandro Camino as saying Lautaro will never fight with Inter to leave the club. 
Never. Lautaro is an Inter player and he is happy in Italy. Alejandro Camino added that, Lautaro is happy at Inter and in Italy. His decision is to stay. Tottenham made a bid for Lautaro days ago, Inter want to keep him. So it appears Lautaro Martinez is set to stay at Inter Milan. This is all we have for you today. Kindly subscribe if you are new. We will respond to your comments so put them there.